Kiwi Fruit, a juicy tale from down under. Good day, learners. Today, we're diving deep into the world of fruits, specifically the kiwi fruit, a popular produce not just in Australia and New Zealand but all around the world. Let's unravel the juicy story behind this vibrant fruit and understand its cultural significance in the English-speaking regions of Australia and New Zealand. Kiwi fruit, often simply called kiwi, in many parts of the world, is a small, fuzzy fruit with bright green flesh and tiny black seeds inside. It's sweet, tangy, and packed with vitamin C. Its vibrant green color is often a pleasant contrast in fruit salads, desserts, and smoothies. While many associate the kiwi fruit with New Zealand, and rightly so, it originally comes from China. The fruit was renamed in New Zealand after the kiwi bird, a national symbol, mainly because of the fruit's fuzzy brown appearance, which looks similar to the bird's feathers. So, when you think kiwi fruit, remember the cute, flightless kiwi bird of New Zealand. In both Australia and New Zealand, kiwi fruit is a popular addition to breakfasts, lunches, and desserts. Its sweet and tangy taste pairs beautifully with other fruits, yogurt, or on top of pavlovas, a beloved dessert in the region. Apart from being enjoyed fresh, kiwi fruit is also used in jams, juices, and as a tenderizing agent for meats due to its natural enzymes. If you ever get a chance, do try kiwi fruit ice cream, a delightful treat that beautifully captures the essence of the fruit. 1. Kiwi fruit can be used to tenderize meat. The actinid and enzyme in the fruit breaks down protein. 2. There's a golden variety of kiwi fruit that's sweeter and has a yellow flesh. 3. It's a berry. Yes, botanically speaking, kiwi fruit is classified as a berry. And there you have it, the wonderful world of kiwi fruits unveiled. From its origins in China to becoming a symbol of New Zealand, the kiwi fruit has traveled a long way. Next time you bite into this tangy fruit, remember the rich history and culture it carries with it. Hope you found this session juicy and informative. Until next time, happy learning and happy eating.